How's the sunburn, guys? Terrible. <laughs> Almost gone. <laughs> Mine's only just starting. Oh, I am not sunburnt. Fingers. I am not sunburnt. I don't know how you like burn your fingers. <laughs> I'm being really an idiot that doesn't put sun cream on. I put sun cream on. It didn't, it didn't work, did it? Did you keep reapplying? <laughs> yes. I don't believe you. Who, who, who thinks to put sunburn on the fingers? Seriously. No. Put sunburn, sunburn on the fingers. See what I mean? I'm tired. I didn't sleep very well. Painful. <laughs> 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 We are beginning. Hi, beginning. Hey. <laughs> Welcome to the Stone Angel Show. Um, week three in July. Yes. Glorious sunshine. You might notice the angle's a bit weird because this asshole forgot to bring the tripod. <laughs> Look, I went to a water park on Friday and took the tripod out of my bag. All right. Sue me. <laughs> it was his birthday, so we'll, we'll let him off for that. Yeah. <laughs> Happy birthday, birdie. Cheers. <laughs> yes, I'm starting off this week 21 again. 21 again. <laughs> Are you? No. <laughs> Feels it. I wish. At, at a water park, you might feel it. <laughs> yeah. No, I felt really old in the water park. <laughs> <laughs> <It's awful. laughs> yes, anyway, third week of July, and I'm, I'm starting off this week. I think I started off last week as well. But thank you for making this playlist this way. <laughs> <laughs> well... It's your fault for choosing ones that I have to transition into other songs with to make it flow nicely. Hey, this is a good song. Anyway, the song I have picked is a song called My Curse by the band Killswitch Engage. If you don't remember that band, if you've ever watched Resident Evil or any of those films, they pretty much cover the whole soundtrack, but this song's not on that. I got into this band because they did a cover of Holy Die. Brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> Take two. Version. Go back to Killswitch Engage. But yeah, um, I kind of just grew up with heavier music, the heavier side. And I was really into this band, and like a band like a Trey U, all that remains. I don't really listen to that stuff like that anymore, but yeah, it just um, like, it, it came on to nostalgia. Nostalgia. Yeah, nostalgia. nostalgia. It just came on shuffle, and I thought, yeah, I'll just add it to the list. I like my heavier side, so there you go. Just kill, switch, engage. This song's mostly in 6-8 as well. Mostly, which yeah. I found out about 15 minutes ago. Yes. <laughs> Amazing things happen when you listen to the songs. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah. You hear things in them. Yeah, band. Kill, switch, engage. Good band. Uh, and also, um, Howard Jones was the uh, vocalist on this one, and he, uh, what I like about some vocalists, they go from the screaming to the um, the calmer vocals, and he, he was a good vocalist. Not the band anymore, but he was good. Anyway, next. Next. <laughs> this is a track by a band called Dance Gavin Dance, uh, featured a song by some of the members of this band previously. Some of them were in um, yeah. uh, Eternity Forever. Almost forgot the name. Almost. Almost. <laughs> Yeah, this track's called Uneasy Hearts Weigh the Most, and it's all about unrequited love. Oh. It's just a really cool song. Uh, the way the guitar lines um, double up with the vocal lines in places, like the perc percussive uh, sort of uh, 16th note sort of riff riffing they do with the, uh, the guitar line. It's really nice. And it's just this really out of nowhere really heavy bit in the middle yeah yeah basically what the hell it's always a nice surprise that one. and then it just goes back to being quite calm and groovy again it's really cool I like this track Betty Clara are going to do it now where they have the really run heavy bridge no yeah. one's chosen them yet no no no, Ooh, no Biffy. Funny, I thought it would have been you for oh, I'm, I, I'm surprised I haven't picked Biffy I do <laughs> I'm quite a fan of Biffy Clara so we'll see maybe yeah. in the future yeah anyway what's next uh, that's me next ah yeah. tune uh, this is a song by Prince this one's Whoop. a little red Corvette Something completely it's different. Something, yeah, something yeah. completely different to the two songs like before. <laughs> this one, uh, just got a nice atmosphere to it. As soon as you hear it, it's, just... it's a tune. Yeah, I mean, it's, just... it's a classic Prince song. Never forget it. The lyrics as well. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, he was. It's all about random women and uh, mm. having a fun time. Yeah, there's a lyric in there about uh, carrying um, little horses in a pocket. It's like Trojans, isn't it? Yeah, sort of thing. He was a league of his own, Prince, wasn't he? He was yeah, miles know. ahead of most musicians. Yeah, I mean we're all Prince fans here. I mean, most I think most musicians are Prince fans. Yeah, they're brilliant. Yeah, yeah. I don't think I've met someone that doesn't like him so far. Uh, my oh, missus doesn't like him. Oh, fair enough. Our producer <laughs> left, didn't they, Barney? Oh yeah, <laughs> joined yeah. a Prince kick. <laughs> he left. Yeah. Oh dear. Who would do that? <laughs> well, he only wanted to watch the band and they were in the pit, so he didn't even see it. That's fair enough. <laughs> isn't it? I suppose if you're paying that much, you want to see it all. Yeah. Yeah. Big Prince fan. Yeah. Which is good. We've got a cover of his in the set now and again. We have. When it, it calls for it. Mm, when doves cry. 
great song from. You still need to do the solo at the beginning there. Oh, no. Yeah. He, he doesn't do it. it. <laughs> <laughs> How often do you get to be self-indulgent? I don't like being self-indulgent. That's why I don't do it. <laughs> You're the least front man, front man ever. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, song by Prince. What's yeah. next? Oh, I've got two this week. Awesome. Um, yeah, this is a song by the band Cooler Shaker. Their song's called Two Sticks, which is their closing track on their most recent album. I say most. Fuck's sake! <laughs> yeah, this is a song by the band Cooler Shaker. <laughs> <laughs> this track's dynamite. With that clap position. So, yeah, um, like I said, closing track of the most recent album. I say most recent, but it was like four or five years ago, something like that. But no, um. It's funny you say dynamite, I don't know if you actually listen to the yes, song. Yes, I have listened okay. to the song. That was a good pun, then. It's a good pun. <laughs> I listen to the song, Sam. Boy. <laughs> but no, um, yeah, it starts off with like a ticking like time bomb, like dynamite, and um, it just it plays throughout the entire song. And it's a, they're a good band. I like Cooler Shaker. I think they're very underrated, especially in the 90s. Because you have things like Hey Dude, and obviously the cover of Hush, but listen to things like Govinda, Tatva. It's got a lot of like, um, sort of like Indian um, influences. Got like some sitar work and stuff in their song, so yeah, they're a good band. They're a good band. I like all cool. nice grooves. Nice grooves, good band. You, you got that album, Charity Shop, uh, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, dropped a quid. Nice. Why isn't it? Genius. One of the best pounds I've ever spent. <laughs> <laughs> Bargain hunting. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, that's that before the phone falls over again. We're going to go on to the next song, which the last is one, Scarlet Heart by Velvet Echoes. Yes. Yeah. Who we played with in Plymouth a couple of weeks ago, three yeah, weeks ago. Yeah, uh, end, end of June. June 28th. June, that's, yeah. 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 Underground and Plymouth, great band. Yeah. Um, considering they're a four piece, and they did, I think they were, yeah, they had to do it as a three piece. They had to do it as a three piece because I think a good, singer pulled extremely out. Extremely good job. Yeah, they, they, they did. Good job, real good job. Sort of sound a bit like, definitely influenced a lot by Arctic Monkeys earlier stuff. Yes, yeah. yes, good. Um, Some nice uh, that sort of style riff. Yeah, yeah. A bit block party esque, I think. But yeah, with, with the, drum, with the drumming work there. and stuff like that. A lot of good, cool drum fills. Um, yeah, it's just like the, all the good parts of the uh, mid two thousands to late two thousands indie work, really, wasn't it? Yeah. And yeah, a good band, really good live. Uh, I think the Plymouth based. They are Plymouth based. They are yeah. Plymouth based. So yeah, good, good local band. I'll go check them out for Velvet Echoes. They're quite a following already, but definitely go check them out. Uh, yeah, they put on a hell of a show. Yeah, yeah. even with just the three of them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I can't wait to see what they're like as a four piece. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Eventually. I'll find out soon. <laughs> and that commences that. this week doesn't it yeah that is indeed that's five it. of the tracks that's all five of the tracks yes so thank you for watching remember to like comment and subscribe good boy and we'll see you all next week you'll see you next week for the last installment of july and then in august we got something a little bit different that'll we? be interesting that'll yes. be very interesting you know so, yeah yeah see you then bye, Tatty bye.